In this video, we'll go over conditional formatting. I'll show you how to change the appearance of individual cells based on specific conditions. I already have a WPF application that has a grid control. Right-click the column that you want to add the formatting rule to and bring up the conditional formatting menu. Let's select the preset rule type. This automatically generates the following XAML code. Another way to add a formatting rule is to use the Collection Editor. Click the ellipsis button for the View's Format Conditions property to bring up the editor. It allows you to manage and edit rules. From here, you can also create your own format instead of using a predefined one. To bring up the conditional formatting menu at runtime, set the corresponding views property to true. And let's run the application. I'll bring up the conditional formatting menu to clear these rules and apply some new ones. As you can see, the conditional formatting feature is a powerful tool that helps to highlight critical information, identify trends and exceptions, and compare data. And that's it. Thanks for watching, and thank you for choosing DevExpress.